Yep, so the summer of 96, my uncle had a Cadillac 1983 Broham. Yes, the much. Huh? No, wait a second. Yeah. Yeah. So my uncle Derek had a 1983 Broham. So he said, says one morning, he's like, Courtney, don't you wanna um drive my car or whatever? So, um, no, he said, you know how to drive? I'm like, yeah, I know how to drive. But I'm thinking he's going to get in the car with me <laughs> and we're going to drive to the grocery store. No, that wasn't what happened. He came back in the living room with a list, the keys, and some money. So I'm like, wait a minute, what am I doing? He said, oh, you said you can drive. You're going to drive to the grocery store. I said, uh, I lied. <laughs> I cannot drive, okay? So I, um, he said, oh, well, you said you lied, so you better figure it out. So that's exactly what I did. <laughs> I drove that car, got behind that bro him and them streets in Oklahoma, um, El Reno. And I whipped that thing first. I was out in the middle of both lanes, weaving it back and forth, trying to control that big old car. But by the end of the summer, I was whipping that car with one hand, lean back, you couldn't tell me nothing. <laughs> so my daddy, he forgot all about that story, right? So I was telling him that was the same summer one day my dad came home, he still had a load that he had to go to Texas to go drop the load off. So he asked me that I want to ride with him in the truck. Cool, yeah, you know, 16. Well, I don't know if I was even 16. Yeah, I was gonna be I turned 16 that summer though. So I get in the truck and um we drive to Texas and on the way back I'm up watching or whatever and the the truck moved up. I'm like, Daddy, he's like, Oh, I'm glad you said something. I fell asleep. I was like, Oh Lord. He was like I'm so tired. I've been working all week. Cause my dad only had that one day off. And then that day he had to protect that trailer back. So he didn't really get the rest that day, right? So he said, I'm going to pull over. I'm going to let you drive this truck. And I'm like, drive this truck? No, I'm not going to. I can't do it. I can't do it. He said, yes, you can, baby. I'm going I'm to tell you how to do it. And at that time, he had the stick shift. The 10, it's 10 shifts in that day. 10 speed. Huh? 10 speed. 10 speed, right? So I was scared because I didn't know how to drive with 10 speed. So I'm like, man, I cannot drive this car. <laughs> so, I mean, it's trucks. I was so scared. But to this day, right now, I wish I would have drove that truck when he asked me to. Because I would I would have known how to do it. So what's your take on that, Daddy? I try to get you to go back in the bunk and lay down. And you wouldn't do that. It hates your back. And you wouldn't know. You never would lay down. Well, yeah, because I don't like to um, sleep when I'm, like, but a lot of times I don't really like to sleep while people driving. I like to pay attention. I told you I had a bad back. Probably, I ain't no telling. I probably was just, I probably was just scared to get on that, get it being back there in the bunker. So I was just like, uh, yeah, I want to be able to see what's going, I want to be able to see what's going on whenever I'm in a car. I thought that would be a cool story to tell you. I'm Uncle Derek, we was talking about it earlier, and I wish I would have recorded it, but I wanted to make sure I told that story because all my little childhood memories, I want to get them out while I'm here because this is a really amazing time. It is really refreshing, resetting, grounding. It's awesome being around family. I'm loving it. Tracy, you got anything to say? Samaj, did you want to add anything with your hand in the cup? No? What us say then? Okay, so Meridian Avenue, we got four miles. All right, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed this day because this day was full with a lot of love, laughter, fun, just family, having a good time, enjoying each other. Something that we have not got to do in a long time, and I really enjoyed this day. In uh, Mustang, Oklahoma, we, uh, we're going all over Oklahoma before we leave here. And you know we got to go to Lima, so we're going to Wichita tomorrow, but we're going to come back down and go to Lima on our way out. Alright y'all, hope y'all enjoyed this. Comment below, tell me how you liked it. 
and um subscribe if you have not man i need y'all to subscribe to my channel i'm putting in some work here i love y'all i hope y'all having a great night or well it's night time now or having a great day if you're watching it in the daytime which you will be because i'm not uploading until tomorrow but yeah anyway as always i cannot wait to see you